You know this constellation Orion? It's got this red star right here. It's called Beetlejuice, and I've got beef with it. I flick this star off every time I see it in the night sky. It's a confusing jerk, okay? It's been dropping its brightness in and out over the last few years, making everybody think it's gonna go supernova, but it's just teasing us. And that's kind of annoying, so this star, yeah. Yep, this is so annoying, I do a whole show around it. Um, the other thing about this star is that it's very, very far away. The star is so far away, it takes 400 years for light to reach it. So my insults are never gonna make it in time. In fact, Beetlejuice is just getting Shakespeare now. The other thing about Beetlejuice is that I once was doing a show here and it came and was really rude. The guest is Beetlejuice? And don't come back! I hate you, Beetlejuice! I hate you! So yeah, I'm an astronomer who has an active feud with the star Beetlejuice. Not that one. But something was missing. I'm a scientist and I wanted to have a scientific reason for this beef. Luckily, astronomy has a wonderful tradition of April Fool's Day papers. Every year, there is an opportunity for astronomers to waste their time writing an April Fool's Day paper. And I've proudly done that for three years in a row now. Folks spend their time writing real, fake science papers and post them on the official archive. This April Fool's Day was my opportunity to do some science and win this feud. 